everybody is talking about GPT-4. Have you heard about it yet? Well, GPT-4 is released now. And the question arises, what it brings to the table? How is it better? What else it can do that GPT-3 cannot? In this video, we'll be finding everything out. Let's take a look to it. GPT-4 is now going to answer each and every problem of yours with even higher accuracy. And not only that, it has now broader general knowledge and problem solving abilities too. The main three pillars that it has improved in are creativity, visual input and longer text. In terms of creativity, it has increased a lot. Now you can even put your restrictions upon the output that you want. Just as this example that they have given, now they want output in the alphabetical order. So GPT-3 might not be able to do it, but GPT-4 now can, due you to know, its increased creativity. Talking about visual inputs, now we are not just limited to text that we use to enter. Now the change is we can even enter images and we can ask questions about that. Just like this example, a picture is given. Now what it is doing, it is identifying each and every item inside it. And then the question is, with all these ingredients, what recipes we can make? All the things are done and it is giving the answers. This is really interesting. After that, if you talk about longer text, there was some word limit, but now you can enter even 25,000 words. You can even enter direct web pages. It will scan every text from there. And on the basis of that, you can ask further more questions. Just like this. You might have also noticed that GPT-3 used to have a very fixed uh, pattern that it used to give answers in. Uh, the first, it defines the question, then it gives the main answer, and then it summarizes it. But GPT-4 is going to give you a two-point answer completely. It is not going to deliver any extra text, so it is way more accurate now. Everybody was talking about how chat GPT is passing exams. Well, ChatGPT4 is doing it in an even better way. Just for the stats, uniform bar exams, ChatGPT used to score near 10th percentile. It has increased to 90th now. Talking about Biology Olympiad, it was at 31st percentile, but now it is ranging in 99th percentile. So that is a drastic change there. Also, some people were putting in very interesting inputs and very interesting ways of how they can answer questions and they were accessing the disallowed content. But this time, it is 82% less likely to happen. And everything is more factual in this. Also, a very interesting thing is that GPT-4 is providing you with API. And that API can be trained in your own models as well. And then you can use GPT-4 as the way you want. If you want to ask it, and if you want to Act, uh, make it act as your mentor, you just need to train the API. If you want to make it act as a lawyer, you just need to train it on the particular data and it will be starting acting soon. So with all the advancements that GVD4 is bringing to you, what you are thinking you would do? Tell us in the comment section. Like this video, share it with your friends. Thank you.